what uh what's this bad brew day i'm hearing about here what you uh, have bad brew days no i never it, it, I, I did a porter one that's no big deal really it probably isn't even that exciting to me but i i, I had a I was doing a porter and I had all the base grains and I had all the what we call special you know, the other grains in a separate bag I had milk. Completely forgot about the special, all the darker specialty grains. I just had the base grains and I'm brewing away and I'm actually getting ready to cool in the wort. And all of a sudden I'm like, I'm like I go in and I don't know, I, I had them in the fridge. I'm like, I forgot all, all the specialty grains in the match. <laughs> just a complete air get, you know? So, but this was early on when I was brewing and you know what I should have did was okay big deal let everything sit you know just do a mini mash with these for you know 30 or 45 minutes at the temperature about 150 or whatever it is and don't sweat it and then add it into the you no know, I, I you know thought I had to get this stuff done quick and I rushed it in that beer it turned out it turned out horrible <laughs> You know, that's the worst thing about a brew day, right, man? Like, you spend six, seven hours, and then, you know, you make a mistake or the beer turns out bad, you wasted the whole, the whole brew day. But that's how you learn. Mm -hmm.